Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Kevin and today is another video of plants that have thrived in passive hydro. Today, the plant family that I'm going to talk about is philodendrons. So the first philodendron that I'm going to talk about is the philodendron micans. She is just trailing away, doing her thing. Yeah, I struggled with this plant when it was in soil. I really did. I'll just hold it here, I guess. <laughs> This plant actually started off as single cuttings. I actually cut up a mother plant that wasn't doing so great in soil. But yeah, I just can't believe through the spring and summer how much this plant grew, especially because it started out as like single leaf cuttings and she's so healthy. It's insane. Like, can we look at these leaves? Let's just look at this leaf. Oh my God. Oh my gosh, this one's cute. <laughs> Sorry. I think it's kind of time to propagate. She's getting a little long and unruly. Again, she's happy in Lekka. The second philodendron I'm going to show you guys is, this is the philodendron brantianum. Look at that leaf. Wow, like she is crazy beautiful. The third philodendron that I'm going to show you guys that is very, very happy in passive hydro is the philodendron bipinifolium gold violin. So, I mean, these two are just showstoppers. Like, look at these two leaves. And as you can see, I have it attached to a coir uh, pole here just so it could climb up. These plants are epiphytes so they tend to climb up things and um, their leaves mature that way. Like all the other plants, I'll put a picture here of when I transitioned it. You could see, although it doesn't look like they're dying dying, they kind of look, well first of all the leaves are a lot smaller and the leaves look kind of limp and I don't know, ever since, like, I mean, it's done so well. This plant also here, um, I think was a stem propagation, if I'm not mistaken, but that's why she's a little bit smaller. She's still cute though. Last but not least has to be one of my favorite philodendrons at the moment. And that philodendron is the philodendron Plowmanii. Um, let me see. This is the most recent here. The one before that looks cute. The one before that looks cute. A bit pointy, but she's still cute. This plant came to me in horrendous shape. I will put a picture here. It was this one leaf. It was Oh, the roots didn't even look that good either. I had to have it live in water for a little bit. I just didn't know if it was going to survive. I mean, I threw it into Lekka. I was patient with it and it just spit out these leaves. Oh my gosh. There's actually a new leaf coming. It got stuck a little bit. I had to help it and that's why it looks a little bit funky here. I don't know if y'all could see it, but there it is. So yeah, guys, I guess that brings me to the end of the video. If you've made it to the end of the video, thank you guys so much. I greatly appreciate it. For those who haven't subscribed yet, hi, my name is Kevin. <laughs> Welcome to my channel. Bye.